Hello viewers. <laughs> this movie you're about to watch is a gospel movie. And I believe that it's going to bless your soul and minister life into your lives. But please, hold on a minute. Kindly subscribe to this channel. Click the notification bell, like and share. Do it now. Do it now, please. If you do that, you have encouraged us. Subscribe, like, and share. Thank you. Thank you. God bless you. Happy watching. Mo, Mo. The tractor. Another retractor. Blood pressure. Uh, Bra John, please calm down. Calm down. Take everything easy. Take everything easy. Sir, they have been in the theater for the past three hours. Let's be patient. Patience? My God is at work. Ah. Patience. Eh? Patience. Let's believe in him. Trust Patience. Him. Yeah. Please calm down. Patience. So. Brad John. Patience. So. Eh. I'm patient. Yeah. All will be well. I'm patient. I'm patient. More. That's all. The baby is not fine. Continue to resuscitate. Blood pressure. More. 90. Adrenaline.
Move, 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 move. The baby did not make it. Okay. Okay. Blood pressure. Blood pressure. 60, 40. It's a ding. No, no, no. Please, what is the situation over there? Calm down. Everything is under control. Ah. Okay. Uh, we, we, when we, can we, I see my wife, please? Very soon. Ah. Very soon. Very soon. Ah. That's what I've been hearing since morning, over and over again. Ah. Well, we still need to be patient. Ah. Uh, I'm No, no, no. My wife cannot die. Listen to me. Don't mind them. I am here with you. They think you are dead. They don't understand. They don't understand. That we have plans of our own. To have two children. <laughs> a boy and a girl. And this is just the first delivery. They don't understand. John, she cannot hear you. Sir, you don't understand. You don't understand. Me for me. We are talk to me and prove them wrong. Let them know you are still alive. Me for me. We are talk now. Me for me. Me for me. to assure you that she will still be fine. Please. But when will she stop all these bad manners? When? 
She will very soon by the grace of God. Lovely. So beautiful. Yes, okay. Okay, yes. Wow. Yes. Wow. So what do we have? Oh. Your man. <laughs> <laughs> Let's have this here. Yes. Good. Wow. And coming up next, we have my love. <laughs> Let's have this here. Yes, over here. Mm-hmm. Like this. Yes. Okay. Nice combination. Wow, so beautiful. And let's get a spot for this. No, 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 no. Mm -mm. What's the problem? That's then my daughter's picture will be hung. Who put your picture wow. there? Wow, Madam Prophetess. Mm, okay, okay. I agree that I won't put my picture here. Mm -hmm. But who told you that our first child will be a girl? Mm. Because you see me like this, Okuni Lada, my first child will be a boy. No, it's a girl. No, a boy. It's a girl. A, a boy. Okay, okay <laughs> fine. God's will be done. Yes. That's yes, our yes. baby's picture space. Yes, I love that. Our baby's picture space. I love that. And I love you. <laughs> John, I told you to come to my house. You said no. Emmanuel offered his apartment. You said no. 
You insisted on coming to your own house. Do you think you can withstand the pain and trauma? <sighs> Our God is faithful. <laughs> I left this home with my wife. <laughs> Hoping to come back with her and our child. But I came back alone. <laughs> oh. What a faithful God. Oh, defend me. <laughs> John. Why are you behaving this way? <laughs> I can't allow you to stay in this house all by yourself. I mean, Abby. Don't you ever know? I need you, I love you. I love you, Femi. You want to love me. You love me. You want me, Jimmy. Come back to me. Omolola, you should be happy. Because you're so fortunate to be among the few that is employed by Crown Telecom. <laughs> Uncle, is it because you can't give me money again? Is the reason you want to expose me to this? No. No, no. Don't get it wrong. I know that you need a job. So this employment is an opportunity. You need a job to be responsible. You see, Omolola, life is not only about clubbing and partying. You are very precious to us, you know. Hmm. Uncle, I know. I know I am irresponsible. Ah. I know I am abnormal. And I know I am useless. Excuse me. Ah. I am tired of all this. I'm tired. Amen. Amen. Thank you so much, Mom. It's careful, careful, my dear. Careful. Where did I put the cash? Please. Is it wait, of... I want to give you something. Just one minute. Wait, this Femi, I'm coming. <laughs> Just a minute. Mommy. Mommy. I hope we can still get to the mall before we get home because of traffic. Did I put your card here? This is Agwabiwere. Nifemi, I want you to take this Agbo every night. Mommy, she has registered for Antinatal already. She won't need this, so. No, 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 no. Office alone is not enough. Ah. She needs local help for safe delivery. Mommy, she won't take it, too. Hospital alone is enough for us. No. I know. I know you want to prove to me that you're a better Christian. But mind you, I'm also a Christian. Taking local app is not a sin. <laughs> mama the mama, it's okay if you insist, no problem. But honestly, the name of Jesus is more efficient than any local herb. I know, I know. <laughs> Mommy, <Problem. laughs> better don't argue with Mommy. him. You can't win him more. <laughs> My dear, let's go. What you are trying to tell me now is that you will not take this local half. <laughs> Mommy, you can't <laughs> see me. <bro. laughs> see this girl. It will help you, Nifemi. It's for your own benefit, my dear. John. <laughs> I said it. 
I said it. I gave you a grumpy when, but you rejected it. I said you should use it so, so that it, it will help her for for her safe delivery. I don't know. I don't know. Did you call it daddy for me? Oh my God, you rejected it. You rejected it. You rejected it. Eh? See what you cause now. See what you cause now. Where is my Where is my daughter? Where is my family? Eh? Where is my family? Oh! Oh my God. And I tried my best. Eh? Just for her to be alive and the baby. I told you. Why you didn't listen to me? Oh my God! Oh my God! Where's my baby? My God! Ah! <laughs> oh God! This wood is too deep. This pain is too much. Why? 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 Why did you injure me this way? Why? What did that owe me in my line of service? I love you. I evangelize. I give even more than my tithe. <laughs> yes, yes. You caused me this irreparable wound. <laughs> oh God. Why me? God, why me? Why me? Why me? Why me? Uh, why me? <laughs> why me? Why? 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 <laughs> you see, <clears throat> anytime that boy is around me, I'm always happy because. Who is that? Yeah. Is this how we will continue to fold our arms and watch her destroy our life? Honestly, I'm confused. I am confused. John, what's your exact problem? It's been six months now that your wife died. Yet you make it look as if it was yesterday. Guy, this issue is affecting you negatively. Yes! Guy, it affects you. Even your efficiency at work had reduced drastically. And I just learned now that you even stopped going to church. This issue is turning you into a psycho. What's your problem? What, what exactly is the problem? God! Yes. God is my problem. He disappointed me. He caused me pain by killing my love. Amy, I can't forgive God. Okay. Um, John, you can't forgive your maker. With the situation on ground, you are the one that is causing a greater harm to yourself because you refuse to accept the reality of her death. Let go of it. Let go. I can't let go.
were you not there when God confirmed her as my wife? Were you not there? Have you forgotten so soon? Did God choose her for me to let me go through this pain? Oh, defend me, my Lord. Defend me. Defend me. I love you. You know that I love you so much. You know I love you so much. I can't do without you. My Lord, when death came knocking, why couldn't you say no? Why couldn't you say no? You know I love you so much. You all love me. He don't know me. He won't need me. John. John. I can't allow you to kill yourself. You'll be my man. I still need you. You know what? This evening, I'm going to take you somewhere. And I'm sure that by the time we get there, you are going to forget all your misery. Guy, cheer up now. Omolola, what is the meaning of this? You have noble birth. Don't you know? Or have you forgotten your background so easily? Uncle, what did I do now? I, I, I don't do anything, Abi. How can you become a street girl? Omolola, how can you become a club girl? So, Uncle, you told me to get response. And I started work by doing what I love. No, 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 no. This is not what I am talking about. Not this kind of work. I, I... Oh my God. Sharon. 
Lekon. Sharon. You of all people. How could you do this to my friend? Someone that had a fatal accident. All because of you. And you moved on with your life with this loss as if nothing ever happened. Sharon, I can't kill myself. So I don't understand what do you want me to do? Do you want me to die young? Please, please, please leave my side. Please, can you leave my side? Leave my side. Go, 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 go. Leave my side. I love that babe. I love her. Oh. Yeah. <clears throat> I love her. No wonder God told me to be here early this morning. So this is what God wants me to see. Ha! Huh? God. That John, when did you start taking alcohol? Mm. Yeah. <sighs> are you are you here to condemn me? Oh no no. Uh, no 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 my brother no. I'm here to tell you that God still loves you. And he's stretching his hands for you to come. Meanwhile, this alcohol cannot take away your pains and wound. Please, brother John, return to God. He loves you. Please. <sighs> Sir. Yeah. I'm already late for work. I I have to get dressed. Who shall separate me from the love of God? Romans chapter 8 verse 35. What else? Emmanuel, I need your help. 
I sincerely love that lady. My heart is so restless. I, I, I can't even think straight again. Oh boy, just calm down. You will get her. Eh? Guy, I better drive. I have to. Drive. Baba, Mama, drive. I have to. Baba, drive. You will get her. What made you call me out? I'm very sorry about the other day. Sincerely, I didn't take you for a prostitute. I love you with the whole of my heart. And I want you to come into my heart and heal my wound. Love? <laughs> what makes you love me? And why do you think I can make you happy? I believe fully that you are the one for me. Please, don't turn me down. I don't know what you're talking about. The countenance on your face. Should I take that for a yes? Um, well, I don't know what you're talking about, but it's fine, okay? That's a yes. Yes. So when you knew you would say yes to me eventually, why did you pour me that drink the other day? Oh Lord my God, Brother John has completely backslide. Please restore him. This situation must not overcome him. Please God, arise for him. Please Lord. Because this is a lady that clubs at will. I was even told that she used to dance nakedly in the club. She drinks and smoke anytime, anyhow, anywhere. I got her a very good job. She refused it. It got to a point that I was thinking of sending her back to you. When I remember the situation on ground, I had to stop. I said, no, I can't do that. But suddenly, recently, we just noticed a change in her, a big one. Yes. She has stopped going to club. Really? She doesn't smoke any longer. She doesn't drink. Now, talks responsibly and she dresses decently but but still we are amazed because who or what caused that change we don't know yet we don't know you you mean she's a changed person now exactly in fact you can confirm from my wife yes Wipe away your tears. You all love me. You don't know me. You want me to me. Don't you ever know? I need you. I love you. How we hold your hands and wipe away.
Angela. Yes, you might have to. Honestly, you are the best thing that has ever happened to me. Oh, but stop teasing me now. What about your late wife? Hmm. That's true. She was the best. And she's still the best. But we are talking about the best of the best. Uh -huh. The queen of the best. Uh -huh. The best that has no rival. Uh -huh. And that is you, my baby. Uh -huh. Oh uh -huh. Wow. You have a very sweet mouth. Uh -uh. No, no, no. It's not about having a sweet mouth. I'm just being sincere. You came into my life and you healed my wounded heart. Honestly, I can't think straight without you. See, eh? all I know is that I love you so much. And without you, I am dead. Ah, uh, no, no. You won't die. I won't lose you. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, no. I won't lose you. Fine, I won't die. Well, come to think of it, ah, all the bad habits I couldn't let go of. I actually did, just because of you, my love. Thank you, baby. Thank you. Then, I was thinking... What's that? Don't you think it's a good time for you to take me home to meet your parents, you know? So we can start preparing for our wedding. Um, uh, okay. Um, not now, actually. You know, I need to... Make my uncle know that I'm actually serious by getting a job. A job? Ah, uh, no. A job? No. What kind of salary are we talking about? Just name it. I'll pay you. Just be in the house. Be a full housewife. Just be at home. Be my homekeeper. Ah. Well, okay. But that will be after we get married. Huh? But for now, I need to let them know that I am actually serious, so please. Oh, okay. Mm. As your love, she pleases. Thank you. That's my love. Amolola. Oh. You mean you want that job back? I'm just surprised. What caused this uh, sudden change in you? Don't you like it? I think I'm now responsible. <laughs> yes, you are. You are. And, and I like it. You are. My God. I like it. It's good. Mr. Emmanuel, yeah. you are closer to the MD. Please help me talk to him. Eh? I can't travel to Canada to present this proposal. You should, you should just look for someone else. Please. But he said you are the best for you. That is a huge mistake. Huh? I am not the best. Lola is the best in me. <laughs> she is my network. Huh? The only server that makes me boot rightly. And once I am far away from her, huh? I will malfunction. <laughs> please, please. Okay, <laughs> malfunction like a computer, have it? I'm serious, I'm serious. I really need this, please. Okay, I will try. Before you start malfunctioning. I'm eh? serious. Babe, what you're trying to say now is you'll be traveling. Like, you will travel, you will go for a good two weeks. Don't you have enough? I need like. you. I love you. I John. Love you. How on I earth do you want me to go? How? And wipe How? I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry. You See, I tried. Me. I tried really hard. Emmanuel you also tried. But the end was adamant. He insisted that I have to be the one to go for this trip. It is either me or nobody. I'm sorry. Hey, hey. I need you. I tried. They didn't. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. Oh. My God, 
I've never seen you in this kind of mood before. Omolola. What's the problem? What has happened to you? What is it now? Tell me everything. Hello, sweetheart. Yeah. See, I'm dying here. I miss you so much. Babe, I'm dying here too. I've missed you. I couldn't even prepare anything for the meeting. Honestly, I was so dumb. Like, I was blank. You know, I couldn't think straight. Why? You know, you are far away from me, so definitely there's no network here. Yes, I thought of something now. Can we make arrangements for you to come over to Canada to be here with me? Why? At least so that my mind can be at peace. <gasps> yeah, that's a good idea. <laughs> ah, hello? Hello? Hello, Amalala, hello, what happened? Ah, hello? Hello, talk to me, what happened? Hello? Hello? Ah, <laughs> What happened? Imanu, ah, ah. Imanu, ah, pick up now, pick up. Ah, ah. Yes, Imanu. Hello, Imanu, can you hear me? She had another accident yesterday, ah. and she hit her head against the steering. Ah, ah, Jesus. I had again. Yes. Oh my God. Oh my God. Huh. Huh. Oh, Lola, it's too late for you to go out now. Please. Mom, let's care. It's like us brother we are talking about. My love. Ah, I know. Okay, let me call the driver to drop you off. Mom, I'm no longer a kid. I can handle myself. Lola, it's dark. And it might likely rain at any time. Mom, remember you have not perfected your driving skills. Mom, I'll be fine.
no, this guy should dim his light. Ah, why now? Ah, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Although there is no obvious physical injury, but the accident is serious. Um, and, you know, she hits her head against the ceiling and she bled into the brain. Oh. We have ordered for cranial CT scan. Oh! Jesus! Jesus! And we are waiting for the results. Mololo! Mololo! I told her to wait for me that I will come and pick her up. But she refused. Oh my God! <laughs> oh. Oh. Thanks for coming. I'm fine now. Thank you. Wow. Who are you people? Uh, do you work here in the hospital? Oh my Lola, look at me. I am your mother. Yes. Yes. She's your mother. And I, I am your father. Huh? I don't know you. Hmm. Oh, Lola. Ah, How doctor. are you? Doctor. Yeah. doctor. Doctor. There's a problem here. Serious one. Hmm. What? She seems to be. She lost her memory from the impact of the accident. Ah. Um, and I believe it will not be too long. And uh, I pray that it's a short term one. Ah. Why is, when is she coming out of this? <laughs> it's just a matter of time. Once she's compliant with her medications, ah. she should be okay. When you are through here, your bill is ready. Pick it up. Thank you. Thank you, doctor. Look at me. I am your mother. Yes. And I, 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 I am your father. Yes. yes. This is your mother. And I am your father. Uh, uh, I said I don't know you. Uh. Are you telling me I don't know my mother and father? Oh, Monola. Who are you, please? Oh. Uh. That is a serious problem here. <sighs> Blood, this is too hard for me to bear. <laughs> My dear, the doctor said it's a matter of time. Eh? Hmm? Honestly, this is too hard for me to bear. Right. My own daughter calling me a stranger. Even the man he was, she was dying to see, hmm. she couldn't recognize him any longer. It's okay. It's all right. Oh, this is too it's okay. Me. It's okay, there. It's okay, it's okay. I don't know. Um, Molola. Yeah, you will follow these people home. Okay? But, Doctor, what have I done to my parents? I made them abandon me to the hands of those strangers. Oh. Molola, we are not strangers. We are your parents. Yes. We are your parents. See, doctor, I don't trust these people, though. Especially this woman. Molola. Hey. You have to trust them. Hmm? Trust them. If you say so. Let's start. So we are? To the house. Molola, please. Ah, uncle. Uncle. Oh, 
Oh, How come? I don't know what I did to my parents. They abandoned me to the hands of those strangers. Oh. They neglected me. Mm -hmm. What did I do? <laughs> Oh. Ah, this is your mom. Eh? Molola. Hello, my MD. Sir, please, I have to be back in Nigeria immediately. My life is getting shattered all over again, and I can't afford to lose her too. Please, sir, I have to be back in Nigeria. Don't you ever know I need yes, sir. Yes, tomorrow, sir. Despite your warning, she told me not to leave the closet with you. Oh my god. But I disobeyed you. It's okay. I'm sorry. Then, could you help me contact Leko? To apologize on my behalf for not being able to. Attend his birthday. So, uh, do you remember Lika? Uh, uh, hey, hey. Jesus. Ah, uh, thank you, Lord. Thank you, thank you Jesus. What's thank wrong? you, Lord. Why are you crying? I said I'm sorry. I school. Let me do them. I'm sorry. Okay. Okay. I'll disobey them again. I'm sorry. Ah. Uh. 
Hello? Ah! Okay. Okay. Lola. Oh, Leko. I'm sorry. I couldn't make it down to your birthday party. Oh, no, no, no. Don't bother. I know the accident was serious. I understand. Thank you. Mommy. Ah, ah. I want Lola. Daddy. <laughs> Mommy, Daddy, Uncle, why did you tell them to bring up food for me? Don't worry. Dad! My love. Oh, pardon me. Good day. Good, good day. I'm sorry. I had to abort my assignment in Canada just to be here with you. I'm sorry. How are you? Your love. <laughs> Please. Who are you? Who is your love? I don't get. What are you talking about? Okay. I know you are angry. I'm sorry. I'm very, very sorry. Mr. Man. I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know you. Sorry for what? Lola, it's me, John. Your love. Ha. I don't know what you're talking about. It's only one love I have. And that is Ola Mileko. No, you know me. Ah. Ah. I was talking with you on the phone when you had the accident. Ah. Uncle, that is where you just missed it. I wasn't on your call. The accident occurred due to the fact that I went out late at night to attend my boyfriend's birthday party. And that was what caused the accident. Emmanuel, don't keep quiet. Please say something. Okay, Lola, you and I were even talking about our wedding. I told you to take me home to your parents. <laughs> and you talked about talking with your uncle to get you a job. Ah. After which you would take me home to start preparation for our marriage. Have you forgotten all of that? Mr. Man, is it on this earth or in dreamland? Ah, you might have to go back to your dreams though. I don't know what you're saying. Don't run me mad. Don't run me mad. Please. Don't run me mad. Gentlemen, at this juncture. It's getting better. Please. Ah, go, I don't go know out. you. Please, you have to excuse us. Go, go, please. Ah. Happy, yes. mommy. I said go. No, no. Go. I am just a mirage. So what? Uh, I never existed. Well, um, I am very sorry about it. You know, she had two episodes of accidents in the time past. And now as it is, it seems that she has practically forgotten 
everything between the first accident and this last one. Uh, which means that everything that happened in between has gotten out of her memory. I I'm sorry she doesn't remember you at all. My memory is, is totally erased from my head. Exactly, that is what ah. it seems to be. Um, I'm sorry about it. Ah. And uh, recently we noticed a, a good change in her and uh, all of us are happy. Uh, but uh, we never knew it's somebody like you. Sorry. Sorry. No, 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 why me? No. Don't you no, ever no. know I need you, I love you. You won't love me. It don't know me. You won't need me. Oh, 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 oh. John. John. Why are you doing this to yourself? Sir. I prefer death than to live. My life means nothing. What happened? My love has deserted me. My heart is terribly broken. This wound cannot be healed again. So I prefer death. I... I don't still understand. I love Omolola with the whole of my heart. But it seems I was just a mirage to her. Now, she has gone back to her first love. And I don't know why God allowed it to happen to me, considering my past experience. Uh, are you blaming God for that as well? Yes, everything. Every pain, every wound that I have incurred in my life was caused by God. Oh, John, I thought you have learned your lesson, but it's obvious that you have not. Why are you crying because she left you? That was how I cried and disturbed when you left me. Little storm, you deserted me and went back to your first love. You went back to the devil. All the love that I invested in you, you wasted it all. But she didn't even remember all the love I showered on her. Not even for a day. Exact way you did not remember all the love that I've showered on you. You left me for Satan. John, you only loved me when things are okay. When everything is rosy. You say good things about me. But immediately things turn around. You left me and went for the first love. John. What else do you want me to do for you? John, you are a big disappointment to me. You have wasted all the love that I have invested in you. <sighs> and a waste of my love investments. Father, I am sorry. Please be merciful unto me. I never thought of you, but my pain alone. I am indeed selfish. Please have mercy on me. John, when you are ready to come back to me, I will be waiting for you where you left me. Um, 
a disappointment to God. I wasted his love investment in me. I've been so selfish. Please, sir. I need your help to go back to God. I'm so sorry. Brother John, God has been waiting for you. He will restore you. He will never cast you away. So far you are truly ready to come to Him. He loves you. God loves you. Thank God you retrace your step. He has been waiting. He is happy that you are back home. Why do